My name is Demetrius Rump, the Director of Safety and Risk Management for the City of Columbia. This is your monthly safety message for the City of Columbia employees and the public. Today I will be speaking about a topic called The Choice is Yours as it pertains to safety, and also we're going to touch on Labor Day safety tips. Everyone has the right to work safely every day, this week, and the rest of their career. But unfortunately, a lot of times, our employees and also citizens, they make bad choices as it pertains to safety. So if you know you need to work safely, why do we still use a chair to stand on to get objects up on, off on the shelf or change the light bulb? Why would you bypass a safety device um, when it's made to protect you in order to complete a task or shortcut to get it done quickly? That's my question to everyone. You have that choice to work safely at all times, so make sure you make the right choice. As it relates to the Labor Day safety, number one, driving. If you're gonna be driving during this holidays, make sure you check your vehicle out before you get on the road. Make sure you're well rested. Make sure that you know where you're going, you have a plan. Don't drink and drive when you're out celebrating the Labor Day uh, celebration. And if you do drink an alcohol beverage, make sure you have a designated driver. Heat safety. Make sure you stay hydrated, or, or drink enough water to keep your body hydrated, avoid caffeine, and make, and make sure you wear loose fitting clothing and not dark colored clothing. Also, those individuals who will be planning to camp or go outdoors, make sure you have a plan because when you go in these remote areas, you may not have phone access, you may not have access to a hospital or to an emergency room. Also, let your family members or friends know exactly where you may be just in case if something happens, they can kind of pinpoint where you may have gone during your outdoor adventure. And in addition, we're in the pandemic crisis, so let's not forget about the COVID-19 safety recommendations by the CDC. Wear a mask or face covering to protect you from other people and also protect them from you. Make sure you wash your hands with warm soap and water for at least 20 seconds, if feasible. If not, use hand sanitizer with about 60% alcohol in content. Make sure you maintain a six foot uh, social distancing if you're gonna be in crowds. And last but not least, let's make sure uh, we're disinfecting uh, with a proper disinfectant, especially high touch areas. As I said, we all have to make choices but make sure you make the right choice as it pertains to safety practices for you and your family. The choice is yours. Remember, safety starts with an S, but it begins with you. Thank you.